Hi Virgo, I hope all is well. This is your next 72 hours psychic predictions. Let's go ahead and just jump into this. I wanna go ahead and thank all my subscribers. I love you guys, you guys are awesome. Thank you so much for rocking with me. And if you're new to my channel, hello, my name is Sean. Welcome, welcome. Okay, so Virgo, we're gonna open it up with Psalms 119.73. It says, with your very own hands, you formed me. Now breathe your wisdom over me. I'm going to repeat that again. With your very own hands, you formed me. Now breathe your wisdom over me. I love that. Amen. Okay. For Virgo, sun, moon, rising. For Virgo, sun, moon, rising, Holy Spirit. What's going on with them? Some of you are... Um, some of you are shaking your head because there's some type of proof that someone did something or something inappropriate I'm getting. There's like some type of evidence of something and you're just shaking your head like, ugh. Um, this, this is going viral I'm getting. Whatever this information is that you're seeing, you're just like, ugh. Okay, it could be something that's trending. I don't know why I'm saying that, but it could be something that's trending. All right, for my Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, what's going on with them? Thank you. We have Slay for you. An amazing job on point. You guys are slaying. <laughs> I like that. Okay, I'm going to take that too. I, okay, I really like this. Okay, Virgo, you guys are very on point in the next 72. I feel like there's some type of tower moment. But this is a good tower moment, okay? This is a good tower moment. I feel like you guys are using your logic with whatever decision this was, and now you're slaying it. It's going to be very different. Like, you guys are very on point. It's like you guys had some type of tower moment, and now you're using your logic to get something done. You're using your logic to get something done. Very interesting. I'm going to pull another card. I'm interested. Mm -hmm. We have the Five of Cups here. I kind of got this feeling, Virgo, as I'm like pulling your cards right now. You're succeeding at something because you had some type of tower moment within yourself. And now you're thinking logically. It's like you're getting away from this sadness and loss. I feel like you guys are getting out of this sadness and loss. For someone here, I'm also picking up on just a few. Something about a divorce or something like that. Um, being on point. Something about a divorce I'm getting. But I feel like you guys had some type of um, tower moment. Or you guys will be having some type of tower moment in the next 72 hours. Um and it's linked to abandonment and trauma, but I feel like you're working on it yourself and you're you're doing an amazing job. That's what Spirit's saying. You're doing an amazing job. Okay. Okay, what else is going on for Virgo? What is in their thoughts? What are they thinking about? I feel like Virgo, you guys are clearer. I'm also getting some of you maybe um, slaying something or doing something. Um, well, doing amazing job for my older people that probably don't know what I'm talking about. Um, you're doing an amazing job when it comes to something on the internet because the King of um, Swords reminds me of the internet as well. It's highly intelligent. Something about on the internet for some of you. Clarification on. Okay. Yeah, this is what, 
Virgo, within the next 72, you guys are wrapping up something. It's like you've become clear. You're slaying it. You're using your logic. For some of you, you're using like the internet with your logic, I'm getting. And you're getting out of this like sad, uh, woe is me stuff or loss or some type of trauma. Like you're leaving some type of trauma behind. That's what I want to say. Like some type of trauma you're leaving behind. And I see that you're definitely focused on that because in your thoughts right here with the bounce, it says leaving the situation or person, um, it's time to leave it all behind. You're, leave, you're wrapping up something. For some of you, you're just finally wrapping up a project as well, I'm getting. Yeah. You're really focused on your independence and you're staying very optimistic right here. You're staying very optimistic. optimistic. For some of you, you might be a little bit forgetful in the next 72 as well. You guys might be feeling a little bit forgetful, okay? Let's see. What is their obstacle? We have viral. Your obstacle. Interesting. Let me pull another one real quick before I say what I want to say. And my phone's ringing. Hold on. Sorry, guys. Okay. For some of you, this is going to sound like... <laughs> if this doesn't happen in the next 72, this is going to happen very soon. I'm picking up on someone's energy where you're about to go viral. Um, become very popular. And it's an end to the situation with the Ten of Swords here. Um, it might be an obstacle for you because you're feeling a little bit overwhelmed by it. But I see something about you guys becoming instantly famous. Um, something something that you're doing is getting around. Um, you may not, if you're not like, oh, I don't want to be famous. It's just something that you're doing is becoming um, known. It's, you're becoming popular. Very popular, I'm getting. And then we have the devil in reverse and the justice. This is karmic justice. This is a release. You overcoming something. Overcoming a situation where you feel like stuck, trapped, lack of freedom. You guys are reclaiming your power. And it is a bit of an obstacle because I feel like you guys with this lucky break, you're going to be like a bit in shock. And like I said, if it doesn't come in within the next 72, it's coming very soon. Okay. Like a state of shock. Okay. Let's see what else is happening for my Virgos. We have you guys mastering something, working smart, working smarter. I'm also seeing you guys becoming very disciplined in the next 72. You guys are being very disciplined. Um, we have the hot air balloon. You guys could be going on a hot air balloon or observing a hot air balloon. But I feel like you guys are rising above. Like you're arising above all your struggles, your troubles. You guys are rising above pettiness. You guys are rising above and finding balance. Okay. Ah! I don't want to take that. I didn't like how all those fell out like that. So get one more. Yeah. <laughs> We have empty nests. Now, some of you might be dealing with a bird's nest, <laughs> something to do with a bird's nest. You might, you guys might find a bird's nest because that's literally how my <laughs> gift works, noticing a bird's nest. But I see you guys moving on and a completion here. That's what I'm getting, something about a completion. For some of you, you might have a little bit of separation anxiety, like you're really missing someone. But I am definitely see completion and ending right here. From something that was very complex, like you felt lost in um, everything seems so complicated. Not anymore. Okay, what does spirit want you to focus on in the next 72 for my wonderful Virgos? I'm a Virgo son, by the way. Virgos are awesome. My husband's a Sag, but he'll tell you something different. He says Virgos are very stubborn. 
<laughs> I am. I am. Let's see what else. We have ritual right here, okay? To experience the magic of your life, you must first practice it. So some of you need to practice, like do some type of ritual. Now, a ritual doesn't have to be all this, okay? It doesn't have to be a pentagram and all this too. Um, it could be your ritual is making your bed in the morning. Um, drinking water every morning as soon as you get up, making sure you have your water. There's some type of ritual. You need to keep, keep up a ritual, okay? Whatever this is, Spirit wants you to keep up a ritual. All right. Let me go ahead and pull some channel messages and... And I'm getting, it's so hard to say goodbye. Somebody is like missing somebody too. Somebody's missing you or you're missing someone. Okay. I know that's random. Let's see. For your channeled ones, I think the next video I'm going to give these a little bit of a break. Still a blue one. Justice is being served, baby. Spirit wants you to know justice is being served. Weigh the pros and cons. They're telling you to weigh the pros and cons right now. And then we have, if you don't feel comfortable, don't go. So there's something that you're going to be invited to or something where you just don't really feel like you want to go. Um, for some of you, Use your intuition because for some of you, you need to step out of your comfort zone, okay? I just feel like I need to say that. All right, Virgo, if you like this reading, hit the thumbs up. Hit subscribe if you really like it, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.